Welcome back to Bombtastic Gaming. I'm Jake. Thank you all for tuning in and all the support you've given us. But if you haven't already, you know the drill. Please hit the like, the subscribe, as well as click that bell so you can get notifications when new videos like this drop. Okay, so for this video, we are opening up our second of the Commander Masters set booster box on the channel. So again, if you didn't see the first one, pause it as always and go check it out. And then there's the card. So you guys can kind of just pause it if you'd like and see um, that's the Commander Precons that are available with this set. So without further ado, we will set these aside. There's 24 packs as always with 15 cards. And we'll just go ahead and crack it open and see what we can come up with. Hopefully, we can get some really good borderless art cards. Kodoma's Reach, the Pearl Medallion, okay. It's a good card. Angel Field Marshal, there's Wrinkle, Thyrex. So a couple good cards to start us off in that pack. And then we'll just, you know, since it's the second box and there's been a lot of box openings, we'll kind of... Um, just speed through the commons, as always. Not trying to make an hour-long video reading and showing each and every one of them. So we got Loyal Apprent Apprentice in the foil. Archfiend of Despair, nice. That's a solid Mythic hit right there. Um, haven't checked the price, though, since um, this set come out. But I, I know it was worth a couple bucks in the old set, so maybe that's a good sign. All right, Living Lightning for our last common. There's Counterspell and your Forest. So, what does everyone uh, think of this set so far? Are they happy with it? Uh, do I, from a lot of groups that I've been in, I I feel like there's been um, mixed reviews with this set. A lot of people liked it. A lot of people thought it was way overpriced um, for the hits. To, you know, so I, I would like to know everybody's opinion on it. You know, we could have a discussion in the comments. Um, me personally, I think it, I kind of feel like it was the same a little bit. Obviously, slightly different than the Lord of the Rings, but I feel like it's very similar to that, that it was just um, like everyone's look after the uh jeweled lo uh, the jeweled lotus in this set where it was like obviously from like like the lord of the rings it was kind of similar where everybody was chasing the one ring and then you know obviously though once the one ring was found the prices dropped astronomically from the set so and then we got a return to dust in the full art nice with the planes foil so that's pretty cool so that's kind of how I felt about that uh, that Lord of the Rings set there. I, you know, I thought it was, um, you know, a little bit too much money. And then I kind of feel the same way. Like, good cards. Obviously, it's another, you know, master set. So, but I feel like slightly overpriced. But we do enjoy opening it. And there are Elvish Mystic. There we go. You know, some definitely some really awesome cards in here. Uh, by now, too, as well, you should have seen the second collector booster box that we opened. Oh, Stroke of Genius. Nice. A list pull. Okay. And a rare. Nice. Sword of the Animist. Giselle Goldmane. Yuriko the Tiger Shadow. Nice. That's a solid borderless hit right there. Like that one. Um, but, but like I was saying, you should have seen the second collector pack. As most of y'all know, we did definitely get a solid hit. Um, uh, Exonuate. There we go. That's a good card. And Generous Gift in Borderless. Okay, so we got a three banger out of that pack. But... Um, Yes, so the second collector box definitely had some solid hit. We got a textured foil. Um, it, that's all I'll say about that. Um, you, you guys can pause it and go check it out if and see for yourself what 
which exact card that we pulled that was a textured foil. I don't want to spoil it so that, you know, that way you go check it out. And if you enjoy it, please, always, as always, hit the like, maybe post a little comment, share it with your friends. That would be greatly appreciated. Truly, 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 we would greatly appreciate it. Token. Rot Shambler. The Scythe Claw. Death Keeper. Zada. Judith. Rise of the Tides. Slice and Dice. And then our Commons. Faithless Looting in the Borderless and an Island. All right, well, that's it for the first row of the um, Commander Masters. Now let's get into the second row. All right, a gold stamped art card. That's pretty creepy. Oh, we got the regular salt ring, but foil. Flawless Maneuver. Song of the Dryads. Mother of Summer. Dude, it feel, it's a hell of a summer here in Florida. Uh, it's been so miserably hot. Let me know. I'm curious to know what everyone, uh, how it's been for them. Uh, I have some family that's been on vacation, like up into the central north of the U.S. And they said it's uh, definitely been really chilly. So curious to know, has everyone been dying of this heat? Or has it been all right where you're at? Orang Frostfang, nice. That's the first I've seen of this card. Borderless, that's pretty cool artwork. I definitely like that one. Tatiova. Foundry Inspector. Mir Smith. Mir Sire. All that glitters, as always. Oh, and then there's the art card. We're following it up with the art card, the borderless, and then the art card. Sarah, Skyblade, the Gluten of Urborg. Oh, man, that thing is creepy. Factor Fiction, we got a Body Double, Swift Response, Generous Gift, Campfire, Commander Sphere, Command Tower, and then Myriad Landscape. Nice, I like that in the Borderless. Now, does anyone know how... Uh, many of these like borderless cards I made like this. There's the Ur Dragon as always. Do do we know? And oh, nice Morophon. We got Morophon. That's a solid hit right there. And Giselle. Okay, it's a good pack. I like it. Morophon's always a solid card. Um, curious to know what his price has become. And then there's the Arcane Signet. Nice. That's our first one of that. So. I know somebody already, one of my friends that wants that. So we're gonna set that aside to give to them. Oh, there's a stamped Ur Dragon art card. We got the Monarch tar token. Oh, Soul Ring, another foil one, borderless. Nice. I do. I'm a huge fan of that Soul Ring. Oh, I definitely like it in the set. Loyal Unicorn, Loyal Drake. The Makeshift Munitions, Blood Aspirant, Legion, Vanguard, Rot Shambler. We got Path of Ancestry, the Opal Palace, and another Counter Spell. Oof. Man, that's creepy. I didn't know they were putting Twilight into this series, into this set. Sancha, the Blade Wing, Hero's Blade, Wanderer Strike, Courage and Crisis. Here's some more commons. Commander Sphere and an Island. All right. Can we get another big hit? I know I would like an Ulamog for once. That would be really cool. Another list pull. The Witch's Cauldron. Fiery Confluence, Toxic Deluge, nice. The Bandit Warlord, oh, sick. Demonic Tutor in the Borderless. Oh, that's so creepy. I like it. What a hit. This is a good box. We definitely had a good box. Would love to see an Ulamog 
or a Morophon Borderless, or hell, even the Jeweled Lotus. Generous gift again. Okay. All right, all right. Oh, and I believe that's old Ragavan, huh? No treasure nabber. I thought they were printing. Did they print Ragavan in this set again? Uh, I'm not sure. I don't remember. Deadly Rolic. Okay, that's a good hit. Heliod. A Mythic. Ashnod's Altar. Burnished Heart. There's a regular counter spell. Deadly Recluse. Kimba. Okay, we got a Kimba. And an Elvish Mystic. Nice. All right. Definitely getting some solid hits here. Now let's move on to this last pack. Any takers? Right now, let's see. What does anyone think that we will get out of the last row in the way of a big hit? You know, will it be Morophon? There's Krinko. Will we get Morophon? Will we get a Jeweled Lotus? What about the Ur Dragon? Can we even get one of them? All that glitters, Path to Exile. There's the art. Flip. We got the token. Or Ulamog. Yeah, yeah. I was thinking, I was like, I know there's another one. Huh. My brain's like squirrel. Crawling infestation with a tragic slip to the ancestral blade, which is cauldron. Witching well. Vandal blast in the borderless. All right. gotten quite a few of the Omnath as well. All right, Generous Gift Foil. Then let's see. Slime Foot, the Fungal Plows, Victimize, Abundant Harvest, Thriving Grove, Thriving Bluffs, and the, wow, Triple Banger in the pack, in the lands, Frantic Search, Reverse Engineer, Frantic Search in the Borderless. All right. Last five packs. Here we go. There's your art card. Oh, it's the Kamigawa Ninja. Got our token. Extra Planar Lens Mythic Foil. All right. Inferno Titan. Ashlyn the Pilgrim. Loyal Companion. We got the Giant Turtle. Meteor Golem. Acidic Slime. Gore Mind. Deep Analysis. And we will... And then I believe this is Kodoma's Reach, yep. In the Borderless, Final Four. Huh. Little baby uh, Triceratops. We got the Bird Token. Kozilek's Predator. Finale of Devastation, all right. Frostfang. The Awakening Sun's Avatar. Experiment. Kraji, Maro Sorcerer, Annex, the Harden and the Forge, the Priest Blood of Right, Pathraiser of Ulamog, all right, good hit. And there's the Flicker, Resculpt, Brass Knuckles, Dark Steel Ingot, Dread Return, and the Borderless. All right, final three, come on, Commander Masters. Come through for us, come through for us. Give us one more solid, solid borderless card can we do it we need it the immortal sun all right the mythic hit that's good another double mythic heart of the wilds then we got the portal mage coveted peacock the thriving moor heath the looter core the giant carrion grub cadaver imp so I got excited because I know the Erd Dragon's pink as well. I was like, oh, maybe. Ah, oh, maybe. Bramp, bramp. We will see. Dread Return. Oh, Despian Stage, the List Pull, okay. Umazawa, the Blood Spore, Fairy Artisan, Lady of the Scrolls, Kin Tree Spirit, Phyrexian and Jester. Feast of Succession, the Elysian uh, Cardetid, 
Thorn of the Black Rose, Read the, Read the Bones, Drown Sorrow, The Battle Gear, Haunted Cloak, and we got facts or fact or fiction. All right, last pack. Come on. Last pack. Here we go. Here we go. Can we get one of the pulls? There's the art card. We got the token. Crows and Tusker. Grand Abolisher. Marin. All right. Couple good little cards here. But what are we going to get for that final card? Bonder's Ornament. Prismatic Lens. The Prism. And Deer's Nightblade. Boink, boink, with a foil swamp. Well, we got definitely got some solid hits out of this box. We didn't get a big one that we're searching for. But, however, I hope you all enjoyed this video. Stay tuned for more content like this. Don't forget down below in the description box to check us out on our other social media accounts, especially Patreon. Become a member so that we can have that community of and allow for community members to be part of the box openings. But, as always... Take care. We'll catch you next time and have a blessed one, y'all.